Hey guys, welcome back to the channel. This is Don Does Life. Uh, today I am doing an Etsy unboxing. All three items came in at the same time, so I'm very happy. I think this one they told me was in yesterday, and then these two came in today. Uh, because as of yesterday, they were not there. So um, all of them are from Etsy. They are all Canadian, which you know I like supporting Canadian businesses. Um, and there's a little bit of something different in all packages. So <laughs> I'm going to start off with this one. This And they came from, uh, so Vancouver, uh, this one was Quebec, and the other one is from Toronto. So all over Canada, let us just go with this. So I ordered some more uh, washi tape. Oh, there was a couple things in there. Dear Dawn, thank you so much for placing another order so she remembered that I ordered before. Hope you love your new tapes. Love cat at 604. So um, just to this time, I got, now I think you guys will probably know what I'm gonna do with this one. Uh, this one is gold foiled skulls. So it's got little foiled hearts and designs and then just little white skulls. So I'm thinking about um, using this to finish my skull painting from Sarah Richter. And it is gorgeous. Let me just take it out of the package so you guys can really see it. Like, look how shiny that is. So pretty. And then I just got a plain kind of um, little daisies on a, a lime green background. Just because I love lime green. And I didn't have anything that was this color. I don't know exactly what I'll use this on. But I'm sure there will be something. Let's see if I can get into this one too. I remember last time I did this, these were really hard to get into, but I think I've kind of figured them out. So there's that one. And I love, so I ordered the full rolls. They also have sample sizes that you can get. And um, I always just go for the full rolls, I think. And it's really, it's really good uh, washi tape as well. Now I did this last time, I'm gonna do this again if I can find my edge. I'll just put it on a card here. So this is the same one I showed you guys last time. I don't have as many to show you this time, but I will use the same card. And last time I got this stuck <laughs> to my mat. So this time I'm going to try and not get it stuck. But I think it just, the black card just shows it off a little bit nicer. So there is that one. And, oh, and they sent me some stickers too. <laughs> and let's look at this one. This is the one I... I didn't want to just order one um, because the shipping goes down if you order more than one, but I was having a hard time finding other ones that I really liked, so I just stuck with the two this time, and I'm trying to build up my washi collection. And there we go. So I think that is... You can catch the uh, foiling on there, but I think those are really pretty. I think that's gonna look really pretty around the uh, the crying skulls. So that is that one. And I ended up, I'm starting to get a little bit of a, a stash of washi tape. So this is ones I got off of Amazon and they are so crappy. Um, these ones I got from, I think these ones I got at the dollar store, and they are okay, but they're not great. And then these ones I got from um, one of the budget sites sent me them to show you guys. And then these are the ones that I have either come in a diamond painting or um, 
or I got from 604 stationery. I think these ones are the ones I got from 604 stationery. And then these ones I also got from a budget site. Um, and I'm not sure what I'm going to do with these yet, but I want to make sure I have enough to go around a painting. I think that'll look really good on an edge. But yeah, I love this little drawer. There's so much room in here. Sorry for the screeching noise, but I just, yeah. So that's kind of, I'm kind of getting up there with my collection. Now I'm just going to move this out of the way and let's get into the next one. So this one is from Sleepy Puppy. So, uh, sorry, this is 604 Stationery. Um, I will link all of them down in the description. They're not affiliate links. They're just links to their store pages on Etsy. <coughs> Excuse me. Sorry, guys. Still dealing with a bit of a cough. Uh, now this one is from Sleepy Puppy. And... Oh my goodness, I don't know what all this is. So it's in French. It says, Le Boite à Surprise. Oh, it's a little, oh my goodness, it's a little cover minder or a little magnet. That is so cute. And then, oh my goodness. Okay, so we got some stickers here. Got a little unicorn. Two unicorns and sleepy puppy. Merci pour votre a shot. Thank you for your purchase. Nice. And what does this say? It's all in French, so I can't read it. <laughs> oh, it's just saying you can join their Facebook group. I don't know if there's a. Oh, there it is. Does have an extra magnet? That is a. That's the tiniest magnet I've ever seen. That is so cute. And it's a little, what is it? it? Looks like a little triceratops, actually. I don't know if you can see that. I'm gonna take it right out of here. That is so cute. I've actually been thinking about getting a metal, um, something metal to hang on my wall so that I can start hanging up my cover minders because I did an unboxing and unboxed a cover minder that went flying out of the bag uh, I think that was the Deborah Malcolm paint, the unboxing I just did. I'll have it linked up there. But the I have not been, I've ripped this room apart and I can't find it. I don't know what happened to it. I don't know if it fell down the heat vent or what. But So I thought, you know what, I need to have them somewhere so that they're easy to put and see. And I don't know how well, it, whoops, you can see that. But that is so cute. So there's that and then okay I did not order this but that is like look at that you guys so this is a 3d tray that is the tiniest tray I've ever seen that is so funny um, but they look like they're really well made and um, then there's this one and this is in a mint green which of course you guys know I love green and I wanted to give them a try and I loved the spout um, on I will show you on so my current go-to trays are the ones I got I got these from Spell Queen um, when I first started diamond painting and I still use them but the spout is extremely skinny on them it works perfect um, it separates the drills really well for me I like the tray but putting them back in to their container can sometimes they can all pile up there so I liked this one uh, because it, it had a wider opening and I, of course I like the color this was this tray was only $14 you guys and it's a 3d printed tray it's very like there's not a stopper or anything but I really like it so I can't wait to try that in fact let's get some drills on here and see what it looks like Look how nicely those separate. Oh wow. That's great, you guys. I like it. It separated them really well. It shook them really well. And I always just put my thumb or my hand over the end. And that's how I don't lose drills out the end. Okay, let's try this little tiny one. You couldn't put much in there, but if you were doing a special, 
uh, that, or just something that had a few, like that is like adorable. Oh, that's so nice that they sent that. So that worked too. That's awesome. And they drained very nicely. And let's just try this. So you guys, the, the, this tray is really well made. I am actually really, really impressed with it. And like I said, it's a Canadian company called Sleepy Puppy. And again, they also will be um, in the description down below. So go check them out. That's a really cute tray. I really, really like that. And let's move on. And I mean, look at the extra stuff they sent too. That's, I love that. Oh, I guess I should put this away. And Cause that's not part of the, and then this one. So I have wanted to order from these guys for a while and for whatever reason, I just, I, I keep forgetting and, uh, and I finally got my button gear and went and got some. So this, some of you will know these guys already really well. This is Sensible by Design. And oh my goodness, that is such a cute sticker. Look at that sticker. So it's a little cow sticker. But I got... So this is Fresh Coffee Putty. This is Citrus Energy and Pumpkin Chai Wax. So I wanted to try the wax because I've never really worked with um, the hard waxes or the harder waxes. And of course I got a candy too. <laughs> I love it when they send candies. So I'm gonna just smell these. Pumpkin Chai. Oh my God, you guys, that is so good. So if you guys know what chai tea smells like, it smells just like that with the hint of pumpkin. It, it Oh, yum, yum, yum. And let's just see. I should have left the, the drills out because I want to, um, I want to try the wax. So let's just pour a couple in there. So let's, and try, so you don't need very much in, in these tips especially, uh, these are the cat ear tips, or the all in one I guess, um, and I love working with them. Okay, so I think you have to like. kind of give up one drill. Oh yeah, they pick up nice. Okay, I have a work in progress here. I'm just gonna pull it out and try placing a couple of drills on it. Uh, just to test it out really quick here. I got this month ago from a budget site. I can't remember which one. Um, if I can find the video, I will link it up in the eye up above. But you guys, it, they're, it's placing really nice. Ooh, and there's a nice little pop. Oh yeah, it's good. I like it. It doesn't seem like it's leaving any residue either. So, like it, it's good. And then the other one, so that's the pumpkin chai. I have not smelled the citrus energy. I love the smell of citrus. It's a very mild smell. It smells kind of orangey, kind of uh, lemony. I'm not gonna uh, dig into it because I've already dug into this one, but I really like to, the, the containers are so cute. So I would imagine these would last a really long time. And then this is the putty, and this one smells like fresh coffee. Okay, so fresh coffee is one of my favorite, favorite smells. 
that smells so good. It smells just like a coffee bean. Oh my goodness, that is so good. <laughs> and not that I can really multi-place on this, but I am going to put some of this in. And this stuff lasts forever too. Okay, so this is, wow, this is really hard. I would assume you don't need very much. I have tried using this before also, um, not from this company. This is the first time I've ever bought from them. But... I think I need a bit more actually. The last one I had, um, it had a bit of a diff different texture, but it, I still have it like. So I have been wanting to try putty again. I think I have it in. Excuse me, sorry guys. I think I might need a few more drills in here just to try and pick up. So this is a seven placer. It picks them up really nicely. Okay, I did that. That was my screw up. So I think you just have to kind of work with it and get used to it. It is a different feel. Oh, now I've got them all together. That's spread out nice. Okay, so I'm just gonna like Yeah, actually, it, it works really good. I've got some wax coming out the end here that I'll have to take off. But it feels good. It's not leaving a residue. And uh, it seems to be laying down good. Oh, I've still got one more. <laughs> nice. So yeah, I am happy to try that. I will definitely, um, on my next painting, I will be uh, using this to see, like more, to see exactly how to work with it. There is a bit of a learning curve with it, um, but it, my understanding is that it's supposed to last a lot longer. And everybody seems to rave about this, the putties and the waxes, so I definitely want to give them a try. I'm going to just stick this back away. So Etsy, you guys, this was a really, really good haul. I think I'm going to go back. I might just go back and order another tray from these guys. I love the color, um, but the price was just phenomenal. And um, Sensible by Design, she has so many scents to try. So I'm sure that there's a scent that everybody would love. And then, of course, 604 wash, uh, sorry, 604 stationery. I love these skulls. I like the, the green one, too, just because of the color. But my God, these skulls are so gorgeous. <laughs> so nice. I, I'm very happy to add those to my collection. You guys, I hope you are staying safe. I hope you are staying healthy. And whatever you're doing, wherever you are, I hope there's something in your day that puts a smile on your face. And as I always say, go grab somebody you love, give them a hug, and I will catch you guys all in the next video. Bye.